Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Shomu's Biology. In this video, we will talk about CS Standard Life Science Unit 3. CS Standard Life Science Unit 3, which is Molecular Biology. CS Standard Life Science Molecular Biology Syllabus, we are going to decipher it A to Z. Alright, so let's begin to talk about CS Standard Life Science Unit 3. So, starting with the CS Standard Life Science Unit 3 Molecular Biology Syllabus. So, again, the syllabus is right in front of you and we have a color coding, green, most important, yellow, moderately important, red, least important. So, starting with this one, DNA replication, most important, belong to the most important topic category. DNA repair mechanism and recombination, DNA damage, repair mechanism, these are also there, which are important and they are moderately important. Next one is uh, the RNA part, the RNA synthesis and processing, that is transcription. Now, RNA transcription, uh, in case of prokaryotes is not that important. Eukaryotic RNA transcription, particularly RNA transcription initiation in eukaryotes is very, very important. The transcriptional activators, the repressors, very, very important. The regulation of eukaryotic transcription is even more important. RNA processing post-transcriptional modification of eukaryotic RNA, be it uh, 5' prime capping, 3' prime polyadenylation, splicing, all are important. RNA editing, very, very important. Structure and function of different types of RNA, RNA transport, all are very, 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 very important. So, keep this in your mind. Next uh, is again uh, the translational protein synthesis. In the protein synthesis part, uh, very much similar between eukaryotes and prokaryotes. The only difference is the 60s initiation complex, 100 is initiation complex. So that is something that you need to prepare separately. But apart from that, the initiation of protein synthesis, that is amino acylation of tRNA, tRNA uh, charging, tRNA synthetase activity, very, very important. I don't know why, but they ask question from this topic every single CSNET exam. Post-translational uh, proofreading is very important. Translational inhibitors, particularly the antibiotics that we use are very, very important. Post-translational modifications of protein are very, very important from this unit 3, from this topic. Then we have control of gene expression at transcription and translational level in prokaryotes. Prokaryotic gene uh, regulation is moderately important here. Eukaryotic gene regulation is also moderately important. So remember the DNA replication, the transcription in eukaryotes translation, post-translational modifications and post-transcriptional modifications among the top topics from CSINET Unit 3 syllabus, CSINET Life Science Unit 3 Molecular Biology syllabus. Now let's move on to the question pattern type, very very important. Again, I analyzed 10 years CSINET question papers to give you this insight. The analytical question and memory based question asked from Unit 3 is almost equal. So you need as much memory along with your analytical skills to answer the questions for CSINET Life Science Unit 3. The next are the distribution between Part C and Part B. There will be more Part C questions than Part B in CSINET Life Science Unit 3. Keep so before going into the next part of our discussion, there is five most important topics from this unit. Let me tell you one simple idea. If you enjoy this video, if you like this kind of knowledge, this kind of information, like who someone studies uh, the complete syllabus and give you a clear gist of that syllabus and topic so that you can prepare in the less number of uh, months, in the less amount of time to cover most of the syllabus, then you can think of joining Shomu's Biology Online Coaching Program. We have all this tailored for you. You can get this ready-made available at your disposal and uh, you can get our study material you can still get some benefit from it so we have different kind of packages depending upon your requirement also depending upon uh, the affordability so you can try out any of our service either study material or our coaching services if you want to get this the link here in this in the description and also we have this number that is popping in this uh, site this is our universal number you can contact this number whatsapp this number the admission for the coaching process will continue and uh, uh, if if obviously we take the students from the admission time frame which is two to two, two and a half months and beyond that time we don't take anyone in the middle so if the admission is going on we'll definitely cater you for that session or i'll tell you to wait for the next session so you can try this out and i believe that nobody is offering two years validity with that much of price point that we are offering so you're going to get everything for two years and two years means four net examinations so it will obviously increase your chance to qualify CS and examination even when you are not in touch with us. So, what are you waiting for? If you wish to join, you can always join in here. So, now we are going to talk about the top 5 must read topics for CS and Life Science Unit 3 syllabus. And these are the topics for, you know, somebody is giving you all the topics. Lot of background work is there. 
so if you like this video please give a hit uh, like as well as share so the first topic here is the dna replication most important second one is translation in prokaryotes and eukaryotes translation initiation the the pre translation events and post translation events prokaryotic gene regulation post transcriptional modification that is splicing uh, processes and adenylation capping editing all these things and also eukaryotic gene regulation that is also very very important particularly the initiation of eukaryotic transcription uh, involvement of upstream control element and repressors and activators very very important these are the topics most important and this is not just my word you can always cross check this by studying last 10 years a senate papers so if you like this video please hit the like button share this video and watch all the video of this series because it's going to be immensely helpful for you and if you want this readily available topics like this and providing to you then you can join our csnet online coaching program